thing sound good. I thought that was wrong. You alright? Good? Yeah. There I got it. You got it. What hurts? There we go. There we go. Check that out. What's up, everybody? Can you can you hear me? Is this good? All right. Uh, I'm back. I'm back. So as you guys know, we 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 got hitched. Oh, that's my hair tie. There we go. That's there we go. There's my cuffs. Somebody said put the cuffs on them, and then every day she comes up. And speaking of, what? You're trying to put the cuffs on me. I love it. <laughs> she loves it. Had a bachelor party, super cool event. You know, as you get older, I guess your priorities change. So we went kind of from strippers and donkeys to just going out in the desert where there was no cell phone service and rock climbing, which was super fun. It was kind of, it was kind of a, a difficult thing. We got stuck in Greece. So we have a bit of a situation. Um, as you guys are well aware, there is a hurricane barreling towards home back in Eastern North Carolina. waves and the wind this storm may bring is nothing like you've ever seen. Even if you've ridden out storms before, this one is different. It's looking like it's going to hit basically dead on um, to Wilmington, Hampstead, Holly Ridge, Jacksonville kind of area. And then we came, we stepped back in. By the time we got back, that was four days. By the time we stepped back in, we immediately just started with hurricane relief and, and trying to affect what we could immediately on the ground. Uh, things have kind of leveled out. There's still people that are rebuilding. There's still a lot of work to be done. But for what we could do, you know, now our supports change from like hands-on to more lo you know, logistical and infrastructure support for everybody. Since the last video I posted about FEMA get, denying appeals, I got reached out to by a lawyer. Um, I'm going to link the the link for the North Carolina legal assistance for the storm. Um, I know one lawyer has already appealed two denials and they were approved. So if you're in the area and you see the video, then hit that link and appeal. Get some get some representation and get your uh, get your family helped out. I so that took a toll and that kind of that kind of paused our like mental planning process for the wedding up until the day before we left. So we worked, I worked 10 days straight helping people and then basically it was time, like the night, that night it was like, okay, wash all the shit and poop off of me, take some antibiotics and then pack my bag to go to a, you know, to a, a wedding, to our wedding. Thankfully, Josh Hansberger, Matt Shelley, Johnny, all of my guys, uh, but mainly Josh and Hannah Hansberger really came through for us and made sure that everything was like planned and then like had our backs and just made the entire experience. What'd you do? I don't wanna talk about it. Hey, there you go, Daddy. I've always thought that I'm just way for a better okay. yeah. Are you all set? Yeah. <laughs> so, what, what did you leave? Babe, I don't, why are we doing this? Why are you doing this to me right now? It's public shaming. Why? Oh, I'm sorry. In the midst of all the hurricane and disaster, the nine people living in my home um, and the eight people living at my rental property that I was providing food and meals for, that I um, displaced my wedding cuff. Why are you stressing me out about this? It means, it means nothing to you. I'm gonna throw yours out the window. From the, on the from the plane? Yeah. That's not nice, man. You know how hard we've been working and how much we had going on and how many people we've had in our house and what we had going on. We're going to Vegas to get married. The time is yeah, coming. Yeah, you just trying but. to punish me. <laughs> This looks kind of ominous. Is this actually the front door? I don't know. Hey! Yeah! Hi there. Hey! Ben! How are you? Good. Hey, Ben. Oh, how are you doing? What is that? Hi, you need a watermelon seed. Hey! <laughs> oh, you guys are doing a good job. Yeah, thank you. 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 Thank
away. Can we hug? Yeah. You gotta go yes. What's up, dude? Oh, it's good to see you, man. Miss you. That looks really big in here. <laughs> we showed up with really no plan, just like we had a house, we had a rental, we showed up and the guys really kind of took it from there. There's a couple little things that we had to do. We didn't have any camping gear. Obviously like it's, it's hard to, to pack. It's not really hard to pack. I do it all the time, but there was just no planning process. So we had to go, we ended up going to Walmart and getting all of our camping gear and all of our supplies, which for me was so weird because I'm used to like having my ruck and having my all my little survival items and my mat and all the stuff that I use. This oh, is the I, way I, I drink I mine. I can smell it. I drink mine just espresso and just a little bit of a half and half and a little flavor and that's it. <laughs> Oh, I just dropped some, and I, I told him, I said, this is, I said, this is the way it's going to go. Like, you read my book, you're going to be like, damn, Nick. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, should I, I want to record this. Say something. I want to say it. With your thumb? Uh-huh. Oh, you're from mental? Uh-huh. So I said, she's going to, like, you're going to read my book, and you're going to be like, damn, Nick, that was spot on, like, really good. And then you're going to get her book, and you're going to be like, oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Oh! Oh! That's what one might drop after the other. I can hardly wait. Yeah. It's but like. For them, it won't be like that. They know the whole story. <laughs> no, they'll still be like, man, I cannot believe she's saying all this. <laughs> yes, I believe Alex. <laughs> yeah, I know, right. You will not be shocked. She is not, she is not holding like anything back. Zero, zero punches pulled. Huh? Zero punches pulled. So much that we should probably get a lawyer. <laughs> I need to call the cops. Yeah, the same place that I called about the punches and stuff. Yeah. And they <laughs> didn't have any of them. Well, I mean, well I let's do this. The then let's do this. I don't even want to have a chance to call like REI, you know, just to be like. Yeah, and like, I Because they have written, I mean, even though they don't, like, fucking know somebody who does. Okay, so easy. So we go to Walmart, we get a few things that we need, throw it in the thing, done. We so donate it. Either ship it back. We can actually donate it to the Raider Project. Ship it back. We just go get this, get what we need for the people that are staying out there, which is only a handful of us. I'm trying to see which which I've got like huh? three, four of us. How many going out there? No, it's one, two, three, four. Johnny, hold on. Shelly's got rope and draws. He said one, two, three, four. Johnny, Stephen. No, wait a minute. Yeah, Johnny, Stephen. Seth, Miss Capra, excuse me, ladies. Four of us. One, two, three, four. Yeah, four. Johnny, Stephen, Seth, Shelly, Shelly. That's it. That's it. That's actually sleeping outdoors. Mm -hmm. That's eight. Mm. Simple. Super simple. Okay. Well, I can make that happen. Back so on the truck, roof of the truck. No, 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 no. Like, because cool. like the parents get in tonight, they're just gonna be here. Because they can like. Cool. Well, my dad doesn't want to go out there. Neither right. does your dad. No. And he's <laughs> like, is there an RV? <laughs> I was yeah. gonna say, let's bring a trailer and pop up for him. And I don't think he's. No. He's like, no, man. No, man. Do you need? Or do you require meat? <laughs> like a I'm big. I'm eating fucking bird seed. <laughs> <laughs> a big chunk of flesh? Are you? I get, food. I get food anyway. Don't you worry about me. Let me uh, see what Mr. Shelley's doing. I mean, are we looking for that fast food or are we going to go? Do you need a big chunk of meat? Because I would go crush In N Out right now. In N Out for sure. Why? We're about to go into the. Have mess. you had In N Out? Dude, no. I had In N Out. It's oh. the best. Your opinion doesn't count now. It's <laughs> fucked up, man. <laughs> he, he talks about in and out like it's gross. No, I'm saying like, we're about to go on an adventure. And? and? Yeah. So in and out's good before an adventure? Yeah, bro, I got toilet paper, man. I would say that, yes, that's the that's We have the three rolls now, so we're good, right? That's the appropriate meal of choice before an adventure. Do you have like gastrointestinal issues that you're worried about or? I mean, I, you're going to shit yourself out in the middle? Probably. I don't know. I've never eaten there. I don't know. It's a burger joint. A have really you ever burger. Have you ever shit yourself after In-N-Out? No. 
Never. Did, did Shelly fly? Yeah. So. He, he was going to drive, but then he's got a car. He had a hotel last night. He needs to check out this morning. All right. There's the menu. Can you figure it out? Four things. There's four things. Oh, three. Do I want a cheeseburger, a double, a hamburger, or fries? Fries are not a meal. Do you, wait, that's the price? Yeah. That's the price for the whole thing. Yeah. Dude, this place is amazing. How can I afford these? So this is what you want. All right. You want, just go with double, double animal style. So double, double animal style, and then when you get fries, go ahead and get them animal style as well. And then I would suggest getting a vanilla milkshake. It's too much sugar. Bro, vanilla milkshake. Do you like vanilla or chocolate? Vanilla, vanilla. I do yeah. vanilla. If you've never had a vanilla milkshake from here, you gotta have one. Nah, it's gonna be more than that. How you doing, man? Good, bro. Oh. Good to see you. Yeah. Welcome, welcome. What's up, man? Hey. How's it going? All right, now we can order. Hey. Now we're gonna order. Wait on you, buddy. This. Yeah. Uh, how are you doing? Hey, Matt. Good. How are you guys doing? Good. Matt, this is my how you doing? boy yeah. Johnny. Oh, right on. Mr. Matthew. Johnny Slicks. All right. So, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, man. Good to see hey, what's up, dude? Good to see you. How you been? Good, good. Busy. Yeah. That's, embarrassing. That's, That's not mean, mine. No, I'm kidding. John is so boring. Who got yeah. the protein style? We got plain fries. Who got? Well, uh, I'll take plain fries. I got plain fries. Yeah. Who got the other protein style? I did. I, got I just got a double double. That's all I got. <laughs> Right? Yep. I'm gonna mess already. Right oh, it's just, oh, yeah. just I wouldn't even wipe until you're done. Yeah, no, man, you just got it. There we go. That's what I bought people in the ring for. They wanted me to do their coffee mess one time. I was like, I'll oh, drink coffee. Wow. Okay, you know, do it. So I bought the shittiest non-dairy creamer and the crappiest, cheapest. Oh, those are eight ninety seven. dollars those are cheap. Put those back. They're separate. There's other ones that oh, are different. Same, same price, though. No, these were the same price, I think. Oh, are they? Oh, cool. I oh, know, this was half the price. <laughs> well, who's the asshole that got that one? You threw it in there. Oh. I'm not calling you an asshole, but you threw it in there. It's Johnny. That's everything. It's everything? Yeah. We just got the uh, weird briefcase to drop the thing back here. Oh, it's the uh, camera stabilizer. Here's what people piece of uh, filmmaking equipment your case for that I'm still paying on. <laughs> It was very Spartan, you know, we, we were just, we just made it happen, but it was an amazing experience. It was so fun. We got out there, and Matt Shelley had got a book from REI, so we were gonna do a couple hours of climbing that night. So we got the book, but the problem was, the picture on this book is just absolutely ridiculous. It was just like a picture of a rock, and then this like map that was drawn by like, I don't know, a, a kindergarten. Like that, you know, and there's been some good kindergarten drawings out there, but this one, was like a mix between a cave drawing map, you know, like 5,000 years old, and, and a kid that drew it. What was supposed to be a 10 minute walk turned into a three hour trek in the desert. But we made it, we figured it out. We'd be like the, the, the weather guy. <laughs> it's really windy here. Okay, uh, picking it up here in Wilmington, North Carolina, right at the Intracoastal, and we're in one of these bands. This is about as 
nasty as it's been. We had some fans like this last night, and then the eye wall this morning, we were not on TV. It was the dark and raucous uh, night at the hotel. And this wind gusting again over 60 miles an hour. Yeah. Right, doing cartwheels in that. So this is, I don't think I've really explained, but this is my bachelor party. And I guess this is what happens when you get older. Your bachelor party turns into from strippers and donkeys to just a bunch of grown men going out in the desert together to get weird. Bonding and enjoying. Oh, we do. We have that? No. Yeah. <laughs> no. 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 Go. Go. No. 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 Need our chai boy? Yeah. Make Johnny bear my stuff. The name sounds really familiar. Yeah. Before I see things, we're gonna be following up. Which one Johnny's going on? What? No. Yeah, well, yeah, same generation. Oh, this one? Yeah. Hoorah! Hannah was laughing at me last night. She's like, you should have never covered yours up. You had an like 1950s Marine Corps hat. Oh, someone drew it for me. Damn. They drew it. It was like the one, the one from here up, you know, with his fucking, with his arms crossed. His arms were crossed, though, you know. Is it an SOI scar? No. Nah, yes, but I mean, it was after that. Like I didn't actually get it done in SOI. But yeah, but still, it was right after SOI. Maybe it was SOI. Of course it was, dude. Sure. Here's your map. Thanks. Figure that shit out, Johnny. You're smart. You do science shit. Shit. This is science. Yeah, bro. Sure. All right. Angles and angles and numbers and there's no distances. There's words. Are we trying to look for this? Cardinal direction. Yeah. That's what we're looking for. Yeah. Yeah, sketch it into a range card. Now you're warm to climb. Yeah. You want to want trade? Yeah. I'll give you my shoes. Okay. <laughs> we can take them, yeah. Trade, even trade. Does that look like that? <laughs> flip flops, man. <laughs> Don't wear flip flops when you're mountain climbing. Because it was more fun to just put it all in that one bag and make him carry it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. <laughs> that's fucking. That's a Man, great plan. We're gonna fucking teach hey, you. Nobody grabbed it. Giant, nobody grabbed it. That's true. He did. He but, went hands on first, so like, pretty much owned it. I mean, that was pretty much yeah, by design. Let's not lie. Yeah, it's not that bad. Here, switch shoes with me. <laughs> Hard pass. All right. Uh, chin up, superhero chin up. <laughs> you're, uh. supposed, you're supposed to look cool. Oh. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> you just the beard. Hey, you shoot the camera. Come on, you're gonna do it, you gotta do it. It doesn't feel good. These rocks aren't soft. They're not soft. That looks like straight out of Shelly, are, is this legit? It actually was a 10 minute walk. We just took a three hour detour. And you know the rules. Uh, rule number one, always look cool. Rule number two, never get lost. And then rule number three, if you get lost, refer to rule number one. Always look cool. Anyways, so we got out there, we got the ropes hooked up, and uh, we actually got some night climb, or we got a couple climbs in. Johnny got his first climb ever. Whoop whoop. Got his first climb ever, and uh, I actually got my first night climb on a headlamp, which is a completely different experience. I'm not just the new guy. <laughs> I am much more than the new guy. Did you wipe all your beard oil off? No. So where is it important to stay in a rope? In the middle? You stay up oh, there. Okay. Holy 
it come from? Well, about 45 years ago, my mom got it. <laughs> <laughs> Have you been waiting all day to use that? Probably, I use that quite often. What just fell off me? Oh, that's not good. <laughs> How did that happen? I have no idea. That's why I don't find in shorts. I'll use what I'll use whatever I can. Is oh, that I why they shoved, is I that shoved. why they wear capri so much? Yeah. yeah. Why? Why? <laughs> God, that'd be awful. Push. <laughs> Push on that toe. Commit. Yeah. See, it's holding you. Great work. Perfect. Excellent work. Keep going. Keep going. Excellent fucking work, dude. Ah! <laughs> oh, good job, man. Thank you. How do you feel? Thirsty. <laughs> I'm going to Disneyland. Excellent work, man. Good Thank job, you. dude. Good job. <laughs> hike out at nighttime under headlamp um, Johnny Slicks decided that he would be the guy to carry the bag and Johnny also didn't bring any tennis shoes and he made a slip Let's go back to camp first. Let's not. Maybe, hey, hold on. What if I can do? What if I walk like this? How does it feel? It's the lateral hamstring. I can feel it. What? The left, the left outer, yeah. outer hamstring. Yeah. Out here? Yeah. So we don't, not really sure what happened. It basically, his knee kept hyperextending, like whatever the ligament is that keeps your knee from going the other way. I'm not really sure. Don't worry, he's fine, I can prove it. Johnny, yeah. can you come out here? Oh, hi. Hi. Um, can you tell the people that you're fine? I'm okay. He's, he's okay. Mom, I'm okay. Yeah, your knee's okay? Like, does I'm it hurt? I'm still standing. You're still standing. You're not wearing a brace, are you? No, I took the brace off today. Is it still hyperextending? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And this is swollen. But I'm okay. So he had a prior prior uh, injury, right? You had two screws in your... Yeah, my ACL ruptured and my meniscus, like, flipped over. So it became scar tissue. So they took it out on the backside. And then they took parts of my hamstrings to make a new ACL. So I have, like, low support. So it wasn't only the fall. No, it was like the previous stuff, but I fell like directly on the on screw. screw right yeah. there. And it's like bruised now. And then my hamstring on the lateral side is like. So he he's going the uh, first week in November and getting yeah. that checked out. And then hopefully. Hopefully they cut me open and fix it. Yeah, I probably just need to like cut it open. I want and, a new knee. And then tighten the screw. You're too young for a new knee. I, well, t whip out your Gerber. Uh, I mean, I could probably just cut use this. Open. Right here, right? It's a Phillips. I could just. Well, I don't know what it is. Yeah. If not, just a hammer. All right, back to back to making product. Okay, bye. Johnny's okay. Uh, and then we went out. We went back to the uh, <laughs> the campsite that night, and we just got weird in the desert with a bunch of guys. It was a great time. And then the next morning we woke up, I got to meet a fan, just happened to be there. He said he was, he saw me on social media and he, and he slept at the camp, at the uh, park all night to meet me the next morning. That's not true, just kidding. Uh, he just happened to be there. I don't know why or what he was doing, but it was cool. 
It was cool. He's local to Las Vegas. And, uh, and always, I tell everybody, if you see me out and about traveling or whatever, uh, don't message me after the fact. Like, come up and say hi. It was it was cool. We had a, uh, a quick conversation that was really neat. And uh, then we climbed the rest of the day. It was just good, man. I like climbing. You guys know this. I like climbing and we had a good time. Hey, here we go. that we have here see how they're all double back yeah so we double back everything so we're just gonna throw this through so like what I'm gonna what I'm checking for is I'm checking for double back here double back here making sure that it's not your straps aren't tr twisted make sure you're double back here turn around make sure the back you can go yep, here good the with this and then this for the so figure eight when you fall, especially like here. here yeah we're gonna tie in there but this what most people do is Pulling themselves up. Just balance yourself on it. Yes, think about legs and not so much pull ups. Okay. Your hands are just to like kind of hold you in place so you can find a foothold and, and push up with your legs. Yeah. Think of where your arms is like ice picks. That's right. the best way to think about that. They're not really for anything. Now you have all the sun. You can see your top illuminates your way. Yeah. Because it's like. It's not like this, like That's this, what you have a chalk bag all for. the holes are kind of like... Like a ladder. You like being sideways. Huh? So do you really like being sideways? Yeah. Alright. Lever works for you. There you go. <laughs> you got it. You got some. Pretty service. <laughs> This is only, this is mine, right? Yes. Yeah. Chris Farley, just walk off the cliff with your bird instead of the tree. Right. Like Brian, yeah. leave no trace. Yeah. 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 That was called for, though. Oh, yeah. You want to get over time? Yeah, Ryan, see you last year. That's what you believe. Oh, yes. Do it. Why? Do it. Do it Are for the vlog. Living? At least some assistance down the Ready? fucking hill. Oh my god. This is just <laughs> hey, this is good YouTube video stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Why do I have to look like the bitch? I have an ARS plus box. Yeah. When they told you you had to go up mountain motherfuckers, they forgot to tell you you had to go back down too. Yeah. Special spot. On your good luck. Ready? Didn't you tell me that going uphill on the worst thing? That's it. I mean, there was the story. We, we, we had a good time, and especially coming from what we what we were doing, and like the filth and the destruction and the the muck. Um, it was nice to get away for a couple days and just hang out with good people and kind of. Let all that come off your shoulders. Just focus on us. We work really hard. So I was able to take a couple of days and just enjoy it. Oh, the book. Where's the book? Hold on. Go ahead and plug this bad boy right here. There we go. So this is uh, Excommunicated Warrior. You guys know I've launched that. It's up for pre-sale. You can get that at xwarrior.com. Also, Vet Expo is happening. You can subscribe to that at www.vet xpo.com and teespring i linked i linked the teespring we just got a bunch of new designs up on teespring go check those out that's it check out the book if you've ever gone through a big change in your life or if you know somebody that's gone through a transition or a change disaster divorce lost a job left the military whatever it is this book is for you go check it out other than that i'm home things are good we're catching up a lot of big stuff in store you guys know the deal never quit Never surrender, always keep moving forward. We'll see you guys in the next video.